Little Bros started off the trip strong. Some BIA impact. Running a free retreat for some boys there. Promoting discipline, self-improvement, true friendship and brotherhood, all centered on good values. Off to an impeccable start. Let's keep it going. Hey, what the flip? How do you guys get here before me, huh? All right, as you can see, we've arrived here in a Muay Thai gym here in Koh Samui, an island in Thailand. I think I've done enough typical travel stuff for the vlog, so I want to challenge myself now. I signed up for this Muay Thai gym here just for a week, nothing crazy. I've just done one session yesterday, and I have to say, Muay Thai is no joke. The guys here, the trainers, the people who come here regularly, they could literally kill me in one kick if they wanted to. These guys are serious. I've got a one-on-one -on -one session soon and just to prepare you, I'm a complete noob, obviously. Everyone's got to start somewhere, right? And yeah, this is me. It's a chicken here, actually. Let me show you. Whole chicken. Yeah. Getting into the session. First off, if you don't know what Muay Thai is, it's basically just Thai style boxing. So you can use punches, kicks, but then also elbows and knees. They call it the art of eight limbs. It has a lot of culture and history behind it. Let me introduce you to my trainer as well for today. His name is Day, which is an amazing name if I do say so myself. Has a stupid amount of fights, an absolute killer. He's gonna train me up today to become the dragon warrior, obviously. So just starting out with the fundamentals. You fire bros probably have a lot to say about my technique, but to be fair, I think I'm a little, a little less stiff than the average dude. So I probably don't look too bad to the untrained eye. Highly recommend just trying out a session, by the way, like locally, any sort of martial arts, super fun, super challenging, but yeah, enough of me waffling. Time to train. Boom! You have now seen me train, looking all cool with the kicks and the punches, looking like a ninja. But if you're into this kind of stuff, you know that if you're a newbie in the gym, you're gonna get slapped up by anyone with any kind of experience.
post Muay Thai grub. Come this way, Alex. We're here at the night market. And man, if this was old day, man, I'd be going crazy on the cedars and sugars right now. It'd be like that scene from Spirited Away when the parents turn into the pigs. But no, I'm a devoted health maxer now. Striving to get 100 HP every single day. I've got my orange juice plug over here. Let's go. Hello. I'm good, thanks. I'm gonna stock up again. Yeah. yeah. How many today? Is it only four left? Only four left. Can I have more? Have Can we have five? Five. Five. Oh, okay. Orange juice plug. I'm a regular over here. All right. Primal orange is acquired. We're gonna try and max out our primalness over here in the market. Hello again. Could I get? Yeah, same. So like. Five, five. Monkey, you that is sick. It's the holiest tree I've ever seen. These guys get all the heck? sun. So they just yeah, come to California see the veggies. First time seeing yeah. a whole, whole elephant. Oh my day! Oh, oh my. Oh, the skin is so thick. Seven, they live to 70 to 80 years old, these. How old is this? Elephants. One? This one. No way. What the heck? Oh. That's this elephant's got more mobility than Dave Mangan's. So. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't do that. Ah. I had to stretch. Hello. As you can see, I'm awkwardly standing here by the water with the view. Give you a little breakdown of this Thailand trip. This country has been such an amazing experience, man. I mean, compared to Switzerland, which was a bump in every department, it is such a breath of fresh air. Everything here is so, so cheap. The culture is one of the richest I've ever experienced. The people here, so smiley, so respectful. And the nature here is so beautiful. I've been to different spots where it's felt so untouched and preserved, at least outside of Bangkok. Yeah, man. Oh, I really love this place, man. I'm so grateful I can be here. Definitely, it's not perfect like everywhere. It's got its flaws. First of all, stray dogs. Watch out, guys. Do not pet these things. You will get rabies. Plastic on the streets, in the water, on the beaches. You see the aftermath of like the huge parties. I'm not, I'm not on some Greta Thunberg business, guys, but this is just the basics, you know. If I'm going to do the rankings, number three at the bottom, got smelly New York City. Number two, it's tough, but has to be Switzerland. Right now, number one. It's gonna be Thailand. I know it may seem like recency bias, but I would say Switzerland overall, if money wasn't a factor, would be better. But just because of how expensive it is compared to how cheap Thailand is, Thailand's gotta be number one. I really love this place. Yeah, guys, one last location left. It's gonna be a banger. Thanks so much for watching. Look forward to next time. And remember, we're gonna make it love. People drop so much money on clothes when you can literally get this five pounds, 100% cotton, no endocrine disruptors, and you can feel like a ninja.